Here's how I built my own Alex Hormozzi AI model that I can chat to and ask for help on anything business or life related. Now this is a ChatGPT model that's basically been trained on every bit of content that Alex Hormozzi has published on YouTube for the past two years. And because of this, we can basically ask any question and it will answer as if it's Alex Hormozzi himself. So instead of paying Alex Hormozzi hundreds of thousands for coaching, you basically have his brain on full display here and you can go back and forth with him and ask as many questions as you need for your business. And make sure to stay until the end of the video and I'll show you how you can do this yourself as it's super simple and just takes literally a few minutes to set up. So here in the prompt, I've just asked the very simple question saying, what business should I start? I only have TikTok marketing experience. And then we want this Hormozy model to be specific and lay out a game plan for the best business model here. We have an answer based on what Alex Hormozy would probably tell us. And he's saying to build a TikTok growth agency for local service businesses. Now, if you've seen his videos before, you would know he's a big advocate of service-based businesses, especially as a first venture. So first, the AI model is telling us to pick one vertical and go all in. So the reason why we want to focus on a single industry, according to him, is that we have to learn its language, pain points, and buying cycles faster than anyone else. Then, keeping in line with some of the same principles, we want to create a no-brainer offer. And this is where we have a framework of a dream outcome, speed, and effort reversed. And then below this, we have specific examples like getting 5 to 10 new high-ticket patients in 30 days. And then we also have a guarantee as well. It also teaches us how we would build our lead funnel for this very specific company. So this is what Outbound would look like, according to Hormozy. We also have how to do the discovery calls with the potential leads as well as closing the leads. Then finally, we want to execute, measure, and optimize our offer to make sure that our business is actually successful. Then finally, we have this roadmap to scale our business up to 10K MRR within two to three months. Now, obviously, this was a very general overview that does use a lot of Alex's frameworks, but this was a very simple question as well. And where this model really shines is when you have specific business questions on an existing business that you own or operate. So rather than just asking some of these general questions, you can technically have this consultant inside your business. So you can feed things like sales calls, transcripts, or even just get general advice on how to scale your own business based on all the metrics you're seeing, as well as all the levers. So moving on, here's a more tailored question. So here I'm assuming that I run an SEO agency specifically for e-commerce businesses. And let's assume that we're stuck at $500,000 in revenue, but we're having trouble scaling. So now let's go ahead and ask this Alex Hormozy AI model what to actually do. So now here's the response that the Hormozy model gives us. The first is to get ruthlessly focused on one high leverage offer. So assuming we're doing too many things like on-page SEO, link building, conversion audits, even writing blogs, this might be a little bit too spread out in terms of our services. And the model is telling us to identify the single SEO service that gives us the biggest and fastest ROI for our clients. Then we'll want to make sure to systemize the delivery so that we can actually increase the headcount inside our company. And then following this, we have specific examples on how to actually increase your sales and marketing. So this is where we write daily content on Twitter threads, uh, short YouTube clips, or even quick LinkedIn posts. And then within our actions, we even have a <laughs> inspirational quote from Alex himself. Then we have pretty standard advice that you typically hear from his videos, like increasing pricing and tie it to results rather than just the cost of doing that action. And then to tie everything together, we have a simple formula to break $1 million in revenue, which is to leverage, systemize, scale, and invest. And then just as a quick example, if we do want to dive a bit deeper into some of the sales and marketing that he discussed, we can even ask which social media has the highest ROI for the SEO business. Now we have our answer. And because we are a B2B business, it's recommending for us to use LinkedIn as the highest ROI. And then for ranking second, we have YouTube and then finally Facebook as well as Instagram. But TikTok probably has the lowest ROI. And the cool thing here is that it's actually able to quote where it's getting some of this information. So they're assuming that good reach among high income users is within Instagram. And Alex Hormozzi himself says this within his social media videos, but he also says that there's a shorter attention span as well as weaker B2B conversion. So you don't just get the brain of Alex Hormozzi. You also get cited sources to make sure that all of the information, especially if it's more quantitatively based, like something like this, is kind of accurate and something that Alex Hormozzi has said before in one of his videos. And like I mentioned earlier, I'm not going to go through like a hundred different use cases of this AI model and what you ask it really just depends on where you're struggling in your business. If you just want a life coach, um, if you want to actually just like feed in sales transcripts and have this Alex Hormozzi AI model guide you as to what you're doing wrong in sales calls or what you can improve upon, you can basically attach any bit of information and just chat with this Hormozzi model to improve your business. Now, before we continue, if you are interested in learning how to use AI like this for your business, 
business, make sure to check out our website in the description as we help service-based business owners utilize AI in all their systems to grow their business. And if you're more interested in just building things with AI or learning how to make money online with AI agents, make sure to check out our community in the description. Now, let me go ahead and show you how you can build this yourself to get your own Alex Formosi at home or just any other uh, financial like business leader that you want to emulate. So the first thing we'll want to do is just go ahead and create a new project within ChatGPT. So here, I'll call mine Project Hormozy. And you can think of these projects within ChatGPT as basically the ability to create custom uh, ChatGPT models where you can add your own files as well as instructions. So rather than having a normal ChatGPT model, it's able to read through all the files you give it initially, as well as instructions, and it'll respond to you in a way that you want. So you can think of these ChatGPT projects here as the ability to create a custom ChatGPT model that's trained on your own files as well as instructions. So starting off, you can see that we can first add in any text files, images, or more. So this is all the information that we want the AI model to have before answering any questions for us. And then after this, the second piece of the pie is the instructions. And this kind of just ties everything together and lets the AI know what to do with the files we gave it and how to behave in their responses. So looking at this from mile high view, we would first add in all of Alex Hormozzi's content, all the text inside the files, and then in the instructions, we want this AI model to only use the information in the files to craft up a response and to pretend that it's basically Alex Hormozzi. So this is just a very simple way to kind of like fine tune your own ChatGPT model without actually coding out anything or training a model directly. Now let's start creating all the files we want to feed to our Project Hormozzi AI model. So like I mentioned earlier, what we want is transcripts of all of his YouTube videos. Now you can do this manually in two ways. The first is literally just to go to any YouTube video here like this sales course uh, for our guide by Hormozzi. If you scroll all the way to the bottom, we can click show transcript. And then from here, we can copy and paste this entire transcript with all the timestamps. But this is a bit tedious and does take a little bit of time. So an even easier method here is just simply copy over this link, then head over to this website called youtube-transcript.io and simply paste the link here and extract the transcript. Then this website makes it super easy. Just simply copy over this transcript, head over to any blank Google document and just paste it in. So here we have 79 pages of just straight sales advice from Alex Ramosi. Now you can obviously make a tool or code out a tool that just automatically gets transcripts without you having to manually find the link of each one. But I want this tutorial to be as inclusive as possible for people with no technical background. So this way anyone can use this tool um, for your favorite YouTube creators, even for like books, authors. You can find all the interviews that Jeff Bezos has done, get the transcript and also do this. So you kind of have like a mini Jeff Bezos as well. But assuming we're doing a Hormozy, this is how it would look like. We would just simply go to his YouTube channel and then just go to videos, super simple. You can find probably his most popular ones, or if you just wanna find ones that you find interesting like this, simply copy over this link, then head back into the YouTube transcript generator, simply scroll down, paste the link here, extract transcript. It takes like a second, copy this transcript, and then paste it into your Word document. And you don't need to format this or anything, just literally do this as many times as you need for all of the content that you want this AI model to basically be like trained on. And then this way it has all of Alex Ramosi's knowledge, like business advice, sales, marketing, and anything else that he ever talks about in his videos. Then once you have all of the text basically pasted in here, what you'll finally want to do is just download this. So rather than downloading as a Microsoft Word file, we want this file to be as small as possible. And the way we would do this is just simply by clicking plain text. This makes it so that whenever we boot up ChatGPT and it first reads through all the files, it doesn't have to read through massive files. By using a plain TXT file, it's able to quickly glance through all the text. So here, if we have files, just simply click add files here and then just drag over all of the Google or Word documents that you have made. So in my case, I separated this out by three different documents. First are all his 2025 videos. And then finally is all his social media advice that he gives throughout either his presentations or videos on his channel. And then with this finalized, basically our ChatGPT model will always read through these project files and based all of his knowledge and responses through these. Now the final step is just to add instructions so that they know what to do with the files we just provided provided the model. So feel free to copy my instructions exactly, or if you're dealing with either a different person or you want to do this in a different approach, you can create your own. But what I've written here is that you are Alex from Ozy AI, and we want them to speak in the first person just as they were Alex. So this means he'll say, I recommend, or when I did this in this specific video, this is how I use blah, blah, blah. 
Uh, we just want to make sure that it actually feels like we're talking to Alex Hormozzi. Next, we want them to base their understanding of frameworks, principles, and tactics only on what's in the uploaded transcript files. This makes it so that we force them to use the files and craft their knowledge around the files that we give them. And then to take it one step further, when we ask for examples or business ideas, we want them to apply the frameworks that Alex Ramosi talks about in his YouTube videos to generate new ideas. So this way, even though Alex Hormozzi never said, like do X, Y, Z for this very specific company, the AI model will still know to apply all the frameworks that he does talk about, like increasing pricing or some other business strategy. He'll be able to basically use those frameworks to generate new ideas. And this is how you're able to fit all of this business advice directly into your own company. And now this is optional, but what I said is to not to quote or reference transcripts verbatim. So we basically just don't want sources after every sentence since it can get a little bit cluttered. And then from here, we also want them to distinguish between framework questions or idea questions. Now this is optional based on the type of responses that you want to get outside of this AI model. And then finally, we want to make sure that this AI model is tailored and specific. So we don't want them to answer questions outside of the scope. So if we were to ask, like, what's the best PlayStation 5 game you can buy right now? Obviously, Alex Hermosius never uh, discussed video games probably on his channel, so it wouldn't be able to answer that question. What this ensures is just that we are actually mimicking Alex Hermosius' thought processes so that if we encounter something that he wouldn't know the answer to, then we wouldn't also show an answer here. And then finally, this is just personal preference, but we want the AI model to basically talk like Alex Hermosi, which is direct, no nonsense, high velocity. So after all that looks good, just go ahead and save it. And now you're ready to chat with this Project Hormozzi AI model. And again, it has all the project files. So everything that Alex Hormozzi has ever said, as well as instructions on how to use that information, talk like Alex, think like Alex, to help you in all your questions so that you can apply basically this Alex Hermosi at home consultant to your business or your life. And like I mentioned earlier, this obviously doesn't have to be Alex Hermosi. You can do this for basically anyone that has any record of written text. So Gary Vee transcripts, um, even Steve Jobs, if you want to get his books as well as his interviews, just literally feed them all into project files here. And you basically will have a mini Steve Jobs, which you can emulate and give you advice to, or just simply chat with. The possibilities here really are endless in terms of what you can get out of this new projects feature from ChatGBT, since you can basically train an AI model to be one very specific person. Now, if you found this video helpful or if it provided any value to you, make sure to like, comment, and subscribe as it greatly helps out the channel. And like I mentioned in the beginning of the video, if you do want to join an active community of AI builders, or if you're a business owner that wants to learn how to best use AI in their business, make sure to click the links in the description.